Hi Virgo, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go, go ahead and get into this Virgo. Thank you God for blessing Virgo with a clear, concise message from you. Alright, so this week we have the Knight of Swords. Okay. And then we have the Eight of Wands, all right? And at the bottom of the, I'm sorry, <laughs> the outcome is the Ace of Swords, not the bottom of the deck, all right? Okay, so some of you concerned about home, family, children, okay? And you could be um, confronting, I don't know, confronting somebody outside of your home, uh, confronting maybe, I don't know, like, you know, um, maybe your child's father, child's mother, there's like confrontation here. Somebody wants to know what your intentions are or vice versa. You want to know what theirs is. You, um, it's also, this could be about money, um, consistent money or consistent, um, energy, um, maybe consistently seeing a child, um, being involved money. Also, it's like, there needs to be a declaration of your intentions, uh, of what you um, what you expect also. Something is coming to a conclusion here. You and somebody else are just not seeing eye to eye. The Ace of Swords is the outcome. It's like now somebody's really seeing the truth of the matter. And that they need to go and make some irrevocable change. Like somebody needs to finally cut something off. Finally be done with something. Go file paperwork. Do whatever it is they need to do to solidify themselves or to find, um, you know, uh, I don't know, find some type of footing in this relationship or this situation because somebody feels like everything is up in the air. There's lots of communication back and forth. That's not face to face. Somebody gets the opportunity to say whatever it is they want to say, but they do not show up. Somebody, um, also likes to string someone along, um, keep someone infatuated with hanging on to their every word, believing a particular person. Somebody feels as if someone's giving them, you know, option after option, ultimatum, and they have failed every way with everything. Somebody could be a working mother here, and they just wanted somebody to show up you know, wanted the other person or the other parent to show up to be responsible. There also could be a career move. Somebody's moving away from a job. Um, it, it, they've been getting some. They've been putting resumes out. Whomever this is, putting a lot of resumes out. They're moving away from maybe one job or one career and going to another. Really severing ties with this. Somebody sees clear. When they understand because there's no more distraction here. Somebody's not letting the other person distract them with their words, with their false words. Let's see what's going on here. So with no distraction, somebody actually sees the truth of the matter. They can no longer hang on to a fantasy. Um, yeah, imprisonment. Uh, so overthinking something, feeling stuck, feeling bound, feeling like there's no way out, um, feeling maybe like even impoverished, feeling like you're feeling like you're doing all of the work, or someone else feels this way. Let's see what else is here. Yeah, somebody feels stuck or trapped in a marriage. Also, someone could be again going to file papers, going to sever the tie. Um. Someone understands that somebody dangles marriage over them, that they're never really going to get married or they're never going to really, you know, yeah, propose marriage to them. Let's see. One more card for Virgo. Yeah, a mature man here. Um, there could be a mature man who wants to get out of a marriage. There could be a mature man taking advantage. Um, yeah, there could be a mature man taking advantage. Somebody's understanding their worth and what they bring to the table, understanding that they can do this all by themselves because they already have been doing it. Somebody's understanding that they're a good catch and they just need to put themselves back out there. There's a, a bit of luck associated with um, 
what you've got going on also, Virgo. Stay consistent because something that's going to manifest for you is something really good. This is what I have for you, Virgo. If it resonates, go over to the website. Book your reading there. Also, find me live here every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. You can ask questions. You can just come for the collective reading. If you feel like you want your own reading, go to the website, book there. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the Buy L a Coffee link. Thank you, guys. Many blessings to you. Take care.